Hello everybody, and welcome to Shin Megami Tensei Tuesday. We'll be getting started very shortly. In the meantime, come on in, hang out, get ready for some fun. Everybody. Once again, welcome to Shin Megami Tensei Tuesday. We're going to go ahead and get started here very shortly. First things first, though, I'd like to go ahead and give a shout out here to my musical guest tonight, who is Amiga777. If you like these hits, I want you to go ahead and go to his SoundCloud page and his Newgrounds page, give him some love, go ahead and check out these hits and more. Alright everybody, we're going to go ahead and get started. Alright, for those who did join us last time, uh, we've been traversing the Tokyo Underground, checking out various different temples. Uh, currently there tonight. Tonight's uh, dedication here is actually to the demon waifus, currently. Off to our left tonight is Naja, who is actually in our crew tonight. She was our waifu in training, and we're just so glad to actually have her back. Let's see here. So there she is. I kind of like her other picture she's got over there. But once again, we're actually glad to have her in the crew. So we're going to go ahead and actually continue. We ended up back here in Rapongi, I believe. Yep. We'll 
start fusing stuff as we go, but there are a couple other places we need to hit up. Also, while we're at it, do we have much money? Oh, we got enough money. Let's buy some gear. You know what? Armor's been... We've been good, but we need better guns right now. First things first, I want to get a... So currently we have M16 rifles, minigun, attack 6040, 4 to 6, and spas 12, damn, 110, 30% all enemies. You know what, I'm almost thinking of getting the spas 12. We're currently locked into the law alignment at this point in time. I almost think we should use that to our advantage because, come on, 110 attack power? Shotgun, Spaz 12, that's badass. I think we'll do that. Waifu gets the next gun next time. Time for Spaz 12, my man. Boom. Now, oh, time to equip that bad boy. Did I pass right by it? I'm gonna laugh. It's like, you cannot equip it. Oof. You know what? Let's sell some stuff. Cause I'm wondering if our inventory is just running out. Oh, you know what? It looks like I did not even buy it. No, stop it, stop it, stop it. We Silly buttons. All the stuff in the inventory because we've collected so much crap from the last time. Alright, let's see. Keep those, keep those. Get rid of the cop killers. Get rid of the scorpion whips. Let's keep one Byzantanto. Get rid of the sonic blades. Nah, uh, Kodachi lights decent. Alti! What's going on, sir? Welcome! <laughs> Green Day over loud speaker is great. Now, what song was it? Because that makes all the difference right there. Dude, it's a chaos only blade. All right, we can't use it just yet. Time to buy us a Spass 12. Yes. Hey, Alti, got a quick question, sir. What are you doing this weekend? Because this weekend, I am actually going to be in town. <laughs> Breaking up with a girl, crying on the phone and being alone. Sounds like a Linkin Park song, man. That's funny, though. Oof, look at that. It's past 12, it is. Especially since I got those mage killing bullets. Oh, that's going to be dirty. All right, wife, who gets the next gun? <laughs> Not one for the kid. <laughs> cool, man. All right, hey, Alti, man. Uh, let me know. Uh, I don't know either. I don't know how wiped out you'll be after Airsoft, like later on that evening or earlier on on Sunday. So we'll we'll think of something, dude. It'll be good times. Okay, I gotta remember which of these temples we hit. Oh, I wish I could, Alti. I'm not actually gonna be in town early enough. I'm gonna be showing up uh, Saturday afternoon. I actually got a few things to get done. Alright, let's enter this shrine. Did we do anything with this one here? Aha! This one we do need to crack. So let's go ahead and do it. This one here is interesting because... I think it's got one-way walkways. Like, they'll start shuffling us different places. Yeah, there we go. And it rotates and rotates and rotates. So once again, for those who are pseudo motion, get pseudo motion sick about this, might want to avert your eyes. Awesome, Alti. I will keep you informed, sir. I will keep you informed. 
Alright, let's see here. So we went like halfway through. Um, Alright, well, let's go out this way, see where it takes us. right back where we were. Go out the north exit. Where does that take us? There we go. Man, it is like... It's like stumbling around in a parking garage trying to find her car after a crazy night of drinking. That's what that's like. Alright, so we're there. Um, Alright, we'll try the one north of here. Okay. Not bad. Not bad at all. Dream of me, because this is gonna be a fun one. Oh, wait, did it stop? Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. Okay. We're going upstairs. Screw this. Oh, damn it. <laughs> So I'll be back. Alright, so no east for that. Okay. Go north for this one to take us back to the other room. Alright, 
backwards, but not going east. Let's go south of this guy. Oh, that's ass. It took us back to the first room. Oh, these SMT dungeons, I tell you. Alright, this guy here, we try north again. Where do we, where is that? Epinos? That put us in the other room. Alright, north it is. Push our luck. Do we go east for this one or we go north? I think we went east for this one, right? East takes you to the fourth room. So, hope everyone is having a decent Tuesday out there. What is new, everybody? South. Okay, you know what? I think we went south on this one. Yeah, okay, good. Now we get you to go upstairs. Alright, let's see here. We're gonna go this way this time. Oh, that is ass. Okay, at least you drive me back to the fourth room. Nope, not going south. Okay, so we don't go that way. So we'll go west, we'll go ahead and continue south. I'll use two. Currently, let's use luck. Because my luck is shitty. Okay. Okay, so we go south. South takes us there. Okay, you know what? Let's go ahead. Let's go west. See what we get. Later games of SMT, like these motion floors, are actually a tad smoother. I know um, Shin Megami Tensei Strange Journey does a decent job of these. Alright, second room, we also go north. Third room, we're gonna go east. And fourth room, we go south again. 
get back upstairs. And south. There we go. Alright, head south to go to that first room. All the way in the f you know, hold on a second here. Make a north this one. That take me closer back or boom. I'm gonna take me back to that first round. Okay. Welcome back, Alty. Welcome back. What is for food, sir? What was for food? This dungeon, I agree, man. I've been writing down which way we need to go because each place is either dropping me in pitfalls or sending me to my doom. So that's the first room north, second room we go north, spin, spin, spin. So like I said, uh, considering you just ate, Balti, you might want to avoid looking at the screen. Yeah, let's see this when we go east. Just make sure you took your Dramamine before watching me play this. And this guy, we go south. North for the third one. All right. So third room, since we exhausted all our options, it's got to be north for this guy. North it is. Okay. All right. North has dropped us off here. Perfect. Okay, alright. In the event if we fall down, I know exactly where we need to go. Or I want to say, ah, dang it. I did. Oh, Alti, I totally hear you on that, man, about long days. Dude, uh, especially like today, man, I was in work up. Uh, dude, there's nothing worse than being thrown under the bus. And then other people trying to get other people involved in it, too. You know, I ended up getting a scathing email from one individual who requested saying, hey, this person needs access to this database, but they never had it, and I'm like, you never asked if they could have it, and they say they did, and they involved the director and other people, and I'm like, oh, you guys. Okay, for this one here, let's try going north. Alright, D-Man, welcome back. Sorry to hear you having a crap <laughs> hating this week. Okay, so we ended up going north for that. Okay, you know what? Let's continue the trend for shits and giggles. We're going to continue going north. Whoa! Guess this is where we need to be. Leave here at once. If you didn't, I'll, I'll send you to Yomi. Who's Yomi? And make you go on a date with Yamoto Shikome. I don't know who that is, but someone better Google it. 
Because uh, if she's hot, I'm going to take him up on it. If she's not, like if she's like his fat sister or something, we're totally just going to have to beat him down. Uh, no. Dude, we're tired from this twisty-ass dungeon. Fine, then. I won't let you leave here alive. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Which part is we didn't call out any other troops. First things first, we're going to try out this Spass 12 and this jerk. All right. Future waifu. Our waifu in training. See if he likes lightning. Original waifu. Go ahead and use your gun on him. Kerberos. Take a bite out of crime. Let's see what we can do. Eat it! Eat it! Alright, that didn't do much of shock. Oh, man, that Spass 12 is pretty. Alright, Nodrum, go ahead and attack him, honey. And, let's see. Gun, Kerberos, go ahead and just attack. Alright, depending how he, what he does this time around, I am actually going to go ahead and I'm going to summon some more peeps. Ooh, shotgun. Oh, I sealed his magic. Oh. Oh, did we just... Oh, we just we just turned him into a little, little bitch. Well, he still likes to attack. Oh, stop touching my wife. Ooh, man, that's not cool. Okay, you know what? Let's summon one more person. Oh, yeah, Mr. Uh, this guy. Alright, now you're going to attack. Wife, you're going to do that. Kerberos, keep attacking. Go. Oh, dang. Dude, I think we turned him into a jerk, dude. He, he can't do much. He can only attack. Well, if that's the case, light him up. Oof, 120 with the Smash 12. Eat it! Yeah, his magic sealed, dude. He can't do a darn thing. Oh! Alright, hold on. I guess I'm better judging I'm gonna do this. We're going to auto. Boom, boom, sword. Eat you up. Oh! You ain't nothing with me and my wife. Is. That's a good amount of mag. Decent XP. Good XP. So you defeated him. Thanks for your help. So you spoke in a Federico? Yeah, I have. You will know what to do with this. Here. I've got the right arm of Moscato. Okay. So... Question is, since we did that... I think this is the only thing we really needed here. Is I almost want to say, I think we got all the body parts. It's almost time for Weekend at Bernie's, man. Put us all the way back there, huh? Well, we already got the body part here, but I don't think we even need to do anything else here. Ah, crap. And let's see, let's see, let's see. I'll go west for this one. Will that take us all the way out? I took you to this guy. I want you to go ahead. South takes you upstairs. North should take us out of here, I'm hoping. Nope. Okay, you know what? Let's go ahead and try this again.
we're back at the first one. If we do... Ah, crap. Hold on a second. Do we go south of this guy? Will it take us back in or back out? Oh, I hate this place. Like, we accomplish our mission. We can't get out of this damn dungeon. part is, though, is that I'm looking at the scope. The, uh... So we're not going to encounter any demons, which is good. Alright, you know what? Let's just go ahead and follow it up back upstairs because I knew there's, uh... I knew there's a drop down in one of these places that'll take us really close to the entrance. Hey, Alti, actually, to tell you the truth, I got some good news today, sir. Stopped by my, uh stopped by the leasing office here and found out there is a one bedroom in this place. I think I already told you via text, but I'll tell everybody else out there now is that uh, my current living situation, which has been comical to say the least, is going to be coming to an end soon. So it looks like I found my own place and I will be moving out. No more drama unless I self-induce. Will it take us all the way towards the back? Please do. Please take us all the way home. Oh, thank God. Okay, here we go. Let's get out of here. Screw this place. Whew. Okay. All right, we are saving right there, man. That was badass. Okay, and... Crap, where did we go to meet that little jerk who asked us to... He might be back upstairs in this way. Oh, oh Pyro Jack, Jack O' Lantern. I haven't seen you in a while, buddy. Don't take this person. We need the money. Sword. But I do have to say though, that Spass 12. Oh my God, that's a dirty gun. Yeah. Okay. King Oberon. Wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. Our guy wasn't here. Wasn't here with King Oberon. We're in the wrong place. You know what? I think we still might need to go back downstairs where we were. Oh, you know, I bet you it's down there. there in the far end. I bet you it's one of those rooms down there at the far end with this guy here. First things first, whatever little money we've accumulated, let's get let's just heal up a bit. Hello, Mr. Guy. Let's knock down that alignment just a little bit. So right now we're law idiots here. Eh, just top off. There we go. Yaddy, yaddy, yaddy. We know. Alright, we'll also pick up some more dudes. We're going to do some fusion later on. Alright, let's follow this up all the way around. Knocker! What's up, buddy? Hey, you know what? No, no, no. He's too... No, I forget. Sorry, buddy. That's a big... You want to fuse? I'm like, no, no, no. There we go, okay. That's where we need to be. Earthquakes, earthquakes. 
Thanks. in here that were making swords or something too. Yep, speak of the devil. Yep. Either that or it's an intense game of chess where one guy uses a hammer. I don't know. What's going on, guys? <laughs> See, I'm busy. Please leave if you're just Okay, I'm looking to buy a sword, jerk. Anyway, he's probably... Gaffey will probably come visit him much later. Hey, you guys. Actually, you know what, Diversion? You're actually part of the crew, man. Let's go ahead and talk our way out of this one. Mag is always appreciated. Thank you so much. If it's not down here, then I'm probably going to need to take that elevator, which I hope I don't have to do. Ooh, magic box. Not yet. What's the moon phase? Is it full moon yet? Is it going to be... Oh, oh, solid wall. Ogre. Light him up. Alright, we're going to see if the goes full here. Oh, these guys. And Knocker. Knocker's like, this is the guy who beat me up. Kick his ass. <laughs> I'm like, okay. Alright, Knocker. Fine. You know what this requires? This requires Spass 12. This guy. Nausea. Go ahead and beat him down. Waifu. Shoot Knocker for ratting on us. Native American dude. What you do? Much you. Light them all up. And Gerberos, do what you do. 73 is like good child. And a ceiling mat. Oh, 236. Mmm, buckshot tastes so good. Yeah, wife is gonna need to get a new gun, but dude, we are rocking the house with these new guns. Holy crap. Eat it. Okay, you know what? Auto the rest. Damn, that was cool. Oh, this guy. Light him up. Alright. Alright, back all the way around. Hit the elevator. We'll see what we get. So I remember before, like, the guys were like, this one, that one ugly Rocky Dennis dude or thing actually had, like, ah, crap, I'm walking the wrong way, it's actually the full moon. You know what, forget it, don't worry about it, we'll get that magical gem later, besides we got plenty of them. Oh, it's the full moon, there's nobody to talk. Okay, bash Twitter for this. I like for a fact that it will hit all enemies. That is amazing. Oh my gosh, that fast 12 is bad. Ass! Oh my gosh, where have you been all my life? That is a badass weapon. Light him up! Waifu, you want it? Can you can you use the head basher? Nope. Never mind. No worries. It is shop food. Mm -mm -mm. Nope. Good. There we go. Go up. Go through.
wait, that's right. This whole place was a one it was a series of one way doors, that's right. Virch, what's up, man? We beat you down last time. Don't take it personal. Light him up. Man, I'm so glad we got this gun. <laughs> Oh my god, it just filled them all with buckshot. They're just like, oh my god. <laughs> and kill the rest with the boom boom zone. Another head basher, alright. Alright, so let's see. Across, up, and across. Okay. Walls are solid. Dude, he just he just can't get enough. This guy. <laughs> He's all sitting there. Thank you, sir. I'm gonna have another, sir. Dude, he just keeps coming back for more. If it wasn't the full moon, I'd talk him down because he's actually part of the crew. <laughs> Since we got badass weapons at this point in time, man, we just need to get new armor, so. There we go. Another head basher. A shop for you, ladies and gentlemen. the other side. Yep. Alright. Boom shakalak. Up them stairs, son. Alright. Where is this little... Oh, my goodness. Please don't tell me this is... Alti, what's going on, buddy? Oh, it's Mr. <laughs> it's Mr. Nandi. Namaste, my man. Namaste. No, we're not guessing numbers today. We need to. We need to leave. So, Alti, what's on your mind, man? Oh yes, I do remember your Adeptus Mechanicus. Yes, I do remember those. What, what's up, man? You 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 found something else out? New. Like new new rumors, new codex, what's going on? Oh oh oh, uh, uh, uh. let's see what you posted, Alti. Oh damn. Guys look badass. Now, Alter, are these guys actually gonna have their own codex? And let's see what we got climbing upstairs. I do like the way they're looking, man. They're all they're all kinda Oh, they're looking badass. Cool, man. <laughs> I totally hear you, Alti. Definitely on spending some money. Come on, where was that little jerk? Seven eighths, I don't care. Open it. Nothing. Yep. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Where was that little guy? Just want to make sure you weren't here, were you? Nope. 
time was there was a little guy who was all like, it's my fault. <laughs> my scout got chopped into six pieces. I'm trying to think, did we get all six pieces? I hope we got all six pieces. Dang, Knocker. Knocker, you didn't get the message the first time, Holmes? My bad. Let's go ahead and make sure that's really, really clear for me right now. So, Ulti, how much are the sets going for for the new guys, those, those Adeptus Mechanicus guys? Because I know uh, from that first link you sent, actually, I did. you did see the various things, like their, uh, their Warwalker and then uh, their Ranger Squad. But uh, how much are those going for, man? Because I know some sets are, like, ridiculously expensive. I mean, once again, the whole hobby itself can be ridiculously expensive, but I meant, like, more so, like, holy crap. Okay, that's actually not too bad, as long as they're not, like, price gougerific. Knocker, seriously, bro, come on. What are you trying to prove here, man? We got the Spass 12, man. He just catches the runoff of the buckshot and he's done. Okay, so have you seen prices of dreadnoughts? You know what, LT? That's actually not too bad in terms of price. Because I remember, once again, this was like back in the day. So, like, when new stuff came out for like 40k back in the day, there was almost kind of like, like a premium price, so to speak. It was almost kind of like, hey, new shit is like hella expensive. Enjoy. No, oh, by the way, we'll knock it down to regular price. So, I mean, they didn't do that long. In fact, I don't even know if they're still doing that. But I remember before, like, when certain vehicles would come out, it would just be like, oh my gosh. Alright, Diverger, you're part of the crew, man. You took a beating from us earlier. And for that, we applaud you. Thank you for the $16. <laughs> oh, yeah. I know it's going to be hell of expensive, man. I mean, that's that, that's the hobby. You know, it's one of those things, too, like, back in the day, I had so much disposable income. And, like, now I'm like, God, pay stupid things like rent and utilities. Psh, what's that? Oof. I mean, I know it's 30, I know it's 40 bucks, man, but... Ooh, but like seriously, if it was like a different type of Marines, they'd be like, guess what? It's forty-five dollars today, and you'd be like, ooh, okay, I'll do it, I'll do it. No, no, I, honestly, Ulti, I totally hear you. It's definitely not cheap. It is a serious investment of a hobby, and this is why I've not parted with any of my stuff because I guarantee you, I have like three grand worth of like miniatures somewhere, and I'm like, I'm not parting with that at all. Stop beating up on wife. Wife who training, I should say. Okay, auto the rest. They're they're weak enough. Eat the boom boom sword. Yeah, Alti. I'm gonna tell you, man. That's actually the smartest way to do it. Cause I had to do the same thing. You know, it was eBay sales or. Uh, was it? I know back in the uh, specifically swap meet sales, that was like really where we would actually, where I would actually get a, the really good prices for stuff. 
You know, guys who had been playing this stuff for years but just really wanted to offload it. Yeah, you can visit the community humans live down here. Okay, you know what? I think that's where we need to go. Oh, man. And you see, LD, like, that sounds like such a good deal, too. You're like, it's like 50% off. Holy crap, let's do it. <laughs> I hear you, LD. I hear you, man. Okay, so we're... Okay, we're down here now. Perfect. Alright, there are those other pillars. What's this guy down here? And let's see. Okay, you know what? He had to have been in here. I really hope he was. Damp dungeons, one-way doors, surface dwellers, keep out. Okay, yeah, this is the place then. Let's try this place with a bunch of haters. And the worst bodyguards ever. Cross and uh, no wait wait. One of these one of these doors actually had him in it. I think it was one of the smaller ones. Hold on a second, what you got? Yes. Got mini rule bug, five tactical terminators, five dogs we can't, a few print not, I can't be captain, Uh you know what, Alti, that is actually really Yeah, Alti, I'm gonna tell you, man, like that's that's the way to go. Because like if you can get it from other people who are looking to trade or like move up or do different things, absolutely. Because that's how I got a majority of like was it I had was like I said I did actually play uh I played uh Tyranids at the time and Space Marines. So that's how I did actually get a chunk of my Tyranids. Yeah, there we go. Under oppression, yada yada yada. Where's your little dork friend, man? Hello, young lady. Nekomata, it's been a while, honey. You need to get back in this crew or we're gonna take you by force. I need you. Yes. Don't you want me, baby? Don't you want me? Uh, what do you mean that ticks you off? Really? Like, really? Okay, once again, guys, th this is how it goes out there. You tell a woman you like her, and all of a sudden she says, what? That pisses me off. You're like, woman, seriously? I just, I just told you. <sighs> and another one leaves. Story of my life. Bass 12, light him up. Wife will use her copulas and light him up too. Work on her and Kerbro stick by our crime. Go. I said shotgun. Pull it for your butt. Hey, Alti, I don't know if you heard about this, but uh, someone tried to, someone was funding this through Kickstarter, but someone wanted to fund a, uh, a Dungeons and Dragons bar. Hold on, what do we got? Cast my favorite features? Yeah, 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 yeah. This is true, Alti. Mm hmm, So true. Someone wanted to use Dungeons and Dragons bar, and apparently it got funded through Kickstarter. So it's gonna be like in the Fort Collins area. I gotta read more about it, but uh, I just found out about it on Facebook, and I'm like, not bad. Good for them. Okay, little guy, are you in here? Oh my God, where is this little jerk? It's pretty neat. Okay, was this guy... No, no, no. We actually do need to take the elevator then. Oh, 
Oh my god, this guy's like... Alright, let's see here. You know what? I do not think it's in any one of... Alright, you know what? Just because I would say it wouldn't be in any one of these rooms, it probably would be, so... Let's go ahead and check it out. Once again, I'll be so glad to get out of here. The roommates fight. I hate it when mommy and daddy fight. <laughs> oh, another magic box. Nah, uh, what's the moon phase? Nope. Uh, let's see. Is he on the far side? All right, we'll check the far side. That'll be so great. I'll be back in my own place. No, hello, Nekomata. Okay, honey. We took this approach totally wrong. You should totally come join us again. It'll be fun. Like the old days. I yes I do. Uh uh no 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 no. Nekomata was enthralled. Oh. Damn it. She wants to fight, huh? Alright. Shotgun! Oh no, I was enthralled. Damn it, that's not good. Okay, let's see if she likes lightning. Waifu, shoot the cat just because she needs to be shot. And my dog is bigger than your dog. Go. Oh my gosh, she is chipping paint. Just someone, someone kill this thing, please. No, actually, ulti is it's just funny now because, like, big series is literally trouble in paradise, man. Stuff has just gotten weird around here. So the best part is, as I told people before, like, my release was up in May, or is going to still be up in May. The good thing is that the office actually has something available for me to move in in the middle of April. So basically, in three weeks, I can literally start moving all my stuff. So I am actually already packing, getting stuff ready to rock and roll, and, uh, we'll just, you know, ah, oh, this jerk with the pink motorcycle. I was so over this pink motorcycle until he showed up again. Oh my god, this guy just ruined my game, dude. I'm, uh, oh, you, you, I'm, I'm upset, I can't even talk anymore. Waifu in training, heal us, shoot him, beat him, and dog just... Just eat his. Just take a bite out of his pink motorcycle. Dude. Come on, wife. Food, training, heal us. Man, she's like the last one to heal. There we go. Better. Alright, light him up. Eat Boom Boom Zord. Verger, what's up, man? You're part of the crew. Thanks for the mag. Oh, really? Like, really? We're doing this today? Alright. Let's hope shotgun shells can silence your fiery screams. Yeah, like I said, it would be so good to have a place again. Now, apparently, this place that uh, they've got for me is still going to be its going to be a second floor, so one bedroom. Uh, they redid the floor, so all the floors are actually going to be hardwood and a uh, little like, tile and file flooring, which is good. That means it's going to be very easy to clean up. Swiffer, don't need the vacuum cleaner. Well, once, once again, I'll keep the vacuum cleaner himself, carpet in the bedroom. But it'll be good. I'll be in my own space again, so decorate as much as I want. Ooh. Kill this jerk. Man, that's a good amount of experience for just one round. Ah, okay, he is not on this floor. Walls are solid still. Okay, you know what? Just for the pink motorcycle, we need to shoot you again. The 
this guy. This guy. I see more of these guys. I need to get go. I have to go get a tasty beverage early. I swear. Wifers, man, holy crap. Okay, shotgun again. Keep us healed. Waifu, you can do the same thing. You need to keep us healed as well. You attack, you attack. Go. Alright, come on, waifus, heal yourselves. the rest. Oh, look at you. Go, wife. Look at you. Alright, let's see. Your speed is decent. Your magic's good. Your magic can always be better. Solid wall still. Man, yes, I would so happen to go the wrong way. Miss Nekomata, not today, ma. Not today, lady. Elevator man, seriously. Okay. I'm right, carrying these guys. How are we doing us? Shoot them. Alright, do the deal guys, light them up. Yeah. Oh my gosh, crit city! I was like, what? What now? Right, we're talking to you, man. Oh, he's crawled too and he's beat himself up. Ooh, Dark Elf, hey, we remember you. How you doing? Oh, snap! <laughs> well, man, let's... Well, let's see, I'm looking at our mag camera. Slowly hemorrhaging. Fokker, what's going on, buddy? Good to see you, man. Good to see you. What is going on, sir? Alright, let's see. Yep, through the second door. You know what, we're gonna need to unsummon somebody. Return this dude. Save a little bit of mag. Okay. Alright, Walker. Sounds good, man. And then you said later on that night you guys were like hanging out. Cool, man. I will definitely do so, buddy. Absolutely. Aha. Might have been down here. Okay. Which... Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. This guy was like, dude, this place used to be called Tokyo, and it used to be cool, and then it got destroyed. 
This whiny old man has lost the will to live. They built a city on top of us. We know, we know. Oh, uh, okay. Hey, Fokker, dude, are you playing? Are you, like, in the Battle of the Bands? Weapons and such down here. Oh yeah. I want to say I think we've got the better deal here. Well, the other place. Oh, you know what? We should have come down here, man. Spaz 12 is like the bottom of the line of this place. That's right. where we bought the bullets. Alright, I'm still liking that Spouse 12. We'll get Wifey one of these later on. And we'll do the armor later. Really? <laughs> We're gonna try and cock block one more time. How you doing? <laughs> How dare you ignore me? What? What are you gonna do? Oh, it's bar fight time. Well, guess what, man? I've got Spaz 12 with the anti-magic shells. Do it. In Tokyo Moon Dollars. Kerberos. Kill. Oh, yeah, no, fucker. We're, 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 gonna, we're off the grind to get some cash, man. I'm just saying, like, this is the place where they have all the stuff. You know what, do I have a teleporter here? Oh, she came back. What's, uh, what's going on, young lady? Yeah, sure thing. What you got? My name, honey, I'm Kanji Effects. Yeah, yeah, that's what she thought. Oh, you can make fun of my name here, huh? Alright, sorry honey. Buckshot. Alty, you don't get into bar fights. However, if you did, it'd be fun. But yes, I wish I did have a Spaz 12 to quell my bar fights. Alright. Crazy old man, weapons and gear. Alright, guy in temple teleporter? Terminal? Okay, it's a body garage there. You know what? Tune up here. This will give us neutral status at this point. Alright, you know what I gotta remember is, was one of these places on the terminal grid? Because if so, man, we're gonna warp back here. I am not walking down this whole freaking way. No, is it Praiser? Hello, young lady. Yeah, yeah, we know. Oppression. Don't worry about it. Oh yeah, the guy and guy's like, oh hey. Okay, we talked to that dude last time. Alright, let's see if he's... Alright, see if he's on this side. If he's not, then he's on the other side. Oh, it's the casino, that's right. Um, you know what, Alti, let me, let me think on that one here. Um, I'm not going to say it's the first, but I want to say it's probably one of the most popular 
most of the ones that really kind of like I want to say that really kind of like spawned something or actually really kind of brought it into the mainstream. Okay, ranks, fortunes. Because I'm trying to think, there's got to have been, I think there have been other movies, but I want to say Blade Runner is the one that literally is like. Oh, Prince of Scott. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's see, I don't know, man, like, you know, once again, I'd have to say, I'll have to take a quick look to see if there was something else that would call it before, you know, that would be before it, uh, but I want to say the most recent one, or one that I still consider now, besides Blade Runner, in my opinion, that actually is, like, the best cy cy <laughs> cyberpunk film, is the original Matrix, you know, because it had it all there, it had everything, it had a dystopian future, post-apocalyptic stuff, you know? You know, challenge against an assertion of, you know, what society was. Yeah, let's see, so he's not there. Crap, dude, this guy, I don't know where the hell this other guy is. We gotta find him. I just really hope we don't have to pick up any more body parts Moscato. I think. Can we, like, see what body parts we got? Of the guy? We don't have anything that says like left arm, right arm. <laughs> Alright, so we're taking the elevator up on the other side. Okay, you know what? Let's check this side just in case. Let's see if they're hiding Rocky Dennis over here. in the box. Oh, Fokker, go for it. Oh, ho! Let me take a quick look here of what cyberpunkmovies.net says. I don't agree with some films being cyberpunk, he says. Yada, yada, yada. You know, interesting choices for certain things. Now, Scanner Dark, I will agree with you on that. AI, to an extent, yeah. 80 Police, hell yes, that is classic. Akira, absolutely. Almost Human, yeah, yeah, that'll work. Wow, you know, hey, uh, hey, Fokker, thanks for dropping this in here, man. I'm going to bookmark that. Hey, no problem, Amiga. Amiga, you are still currently the Artist of the Week. I'm still waiting to hear back from new stuff from Fernia and, um, and, uh, Garode. So, uh, Amiga said, you know, once I get new stuff from them, man, I'll go ahead and put them back in rotation. But, uh, like I said, right now, dude, we're still trying to go through, like, a lot of the stuff that you put in, which was really good. Alright, you know what? Hold on a second here. Let me... Oh, nope. Not gonna go back through one way door. Let me go back around. I'm going to check those two things up there in the corner. Diverger, what's up? Part of the crew? Oh, young lady Nekumata. Alright, we're doing this right this time. Woman getting the crew. Now. It's just my hobby, baby. Chill. Oh, you know what? You know what, Fokker? I, 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 I won't agree with you. You know what? I want to agree with you because I'm not sure if, you know, Heavy Metal counts as cyberpunk. I want to say it had elements of it with a couple of the stories they told, like one or two of the stories they told, like the guy in the cab. 
where you know the the chick found the Loch Ness, etc. Like that, I kind of would say it it is, but not as a whole as a movie. Like one of the actual one of the short stories. Yeah. Uh, let's see. What? I'll smack you up. Change my pitch up. Smack my pitch up. All right, she's going down. Light her up. Let's see. Looker is this? Oh. oh. Really, guys, we're doing this again. Okay. These guys want a piece. All right. Let's see. Attack. Attack. But uh, I will agree, and that's one thing too, is like, especially with that cyberpunk movies.net thing, like, they're pulling a lot of anime titles. A lot of the anime titles are things I actually agree with, like stuff that is the bubblegum crisis, 80 police files, stuff that is that really gritty cyberpunk craziness. <laughs> Ooh, just a deck. to be sure here. Uh -huh. Sure. Don't. Yeah, that's right. Foot time. New moon. Nope, there is no gem. Gems only occur upon the full moon. Hello, Dark Elf. Hey, Dark Elf. We need you to get back in this crew. Which films were those? Actually, you know what, Alti, take that back. You know what, now that you mention it, dude, the original Metropolis silent film. That technically was cyberpunk, if you think about it. Dealing with oppression of the masses, etc. You know what, I would, I would actually I would actually almost say that one would count. What's up, Dark Elf? How are you? I will listen to your wish. Oh, damn, really? Okay, let her up. Light her up. Right on, Walker. Right on, but yeah. So I was gonna say the original. Yeah, Metropolis. I'm like, yup. Now, Alti, in the event if you decide to check that one out, be ready. It is a silent film. Oh my goodness. Now which movie is this one, Alti? Because I'm looking at a lot of those on there, and like those, they got some really good ones actually. Oh man, Android Insurrection, now, I've actually seen that one, and that is all types of bad. It's one of those so bad it's good. And we got Apple C. Avalon, Cyber Wars, Battle Angel Elite is another good one. Oh my god, stop beating up on wife and holy crap. Alright, now it is Spaz 12 time. You attack wife and eat orbs so you do not die.
right, let's make our way through. No, yeah, we just came from B B two, didn't we? Yep, we're gonna need to go up to the top. Go up to the first floor on the other side. Let's see. Alty, what do you got here? Oh, you know what? You know, I am actually going to disagree with that Wikipedia thing. I'm literally going to state William Gibson was the guy I think he coined Cyberpunk. I wouldn't necessarily state it was Gardner does it. Does yes, I would I, I wouldn't agree with that one. But once again, it's all right. Okay, he has to that little jerk has to be up here now. He has to be in this place. Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, he's here. He's got me up here now. But hey, how are we going to go? We collected all the dead body parts you wanted. Now what? Because I hope we got them all. So if we didn't, I'm going to be like, crap, man, who's left? What? Damn it, I did not get them all done. But uh actually yeah, but you know what though? Like I would I'm trying to think though because even just even just studying like film and a few other things though is that there was another person who actually coined the term cyberpunk for it to actually become popular. And actually no no no, you know what? It might have been Philip K. Dick, you never know. Right about that. It probably could have been. That's right. Philip K. Dick was writing some crazy, crazy stuff way back in the day. It could have been Philip K. Dick. Okay, so you know what? So that means we went through four. We've there's like one other temple we're missing. Oh, really? This guy again? All right, let's talk to the girl. See if he doesn't notice. Yeah, yeah. I see that's too bad. No, that's right, that is too bad. Nope. Ah, that's it. Alright, light him up. Let's see. Actually, yeah, you know what? That that is, and actually actually Fokker, that's true because that movie well that book is actually the precursor to uh you know or the basis or what Blade Runner was called based upon. Highly recommend reading that book if you have not. It's pretty cool. Read it all the way to the end. It's pretty, like, freaking awesome. I should speak much. I know I got a copy of that book right here somewhere. <laughs> More yay customers. <laughs> Alright, let's see. I'm doing good. Luck is decent. Beast mode and full effect. Alright, so let's see here. Alright, let's go around the other side. And I need to find out. Apparently there's one more piece. Another piece we're missing here from... Ugh, these guys again. First gun, attack, attack. Oh, now you know what? We can remember for you wholesale. I liked that book. Once again, that's what that's what a uh, Total Recall was based upon, ladies and gentlemen, kids. And now here's the thing, Scanner Darkly, I really like. I really like the style of how they actually kind of made everything just that cell shadedness of over, over the film. 
It was really cool. Let's see. Come on, we're around to the side. Rotoscope. Man, I missed that. Good turns for rotoscoping. Oh, man, that's, that's crazy. And uh, anyway, for you kids or other film people out there for rotoscoping, rotoscoping is literally making alterations to each and every single frame of that said film. So uh, there's a lot of rotoscoping in The Matrix, a lot of rotoscoping in different things. And I've even done rotoscoping for smaller projects, and it is a nightmare. It's kind of like a labor of love, you know? You're like, I can't believe I have to do like a <laughs> 200 frames. But oh man, when I get it done, it's gonna look so freaking good. Yeah, Falker, that's actually really true. And I actually tell you the truth, uh, it'll probably end up being less, considering it takes, you know, film going at 24 frames a second. I mean, honestly, depending upon other stuff, it might only be, it might be less than that, depending. Uh, you know what, auto this jerk. Go home, take it. Take it, take it hard. But, I don't know, and that's the thing, too, is like, that's the best part about Roto is that if you like if you see something and you don't even recognize what it like you know recognize that like it was actually done Roto wise, that's some perfect rotoscope work. Other times you'd be like, oh I see what they're doing and it looks crappy. But yeah, you know what, Alti, that's actually true. Well here's the thing though, is that you got different stories from different parts of the world where they all got their own thing, and I could see that happening. I could seriously see them actually writing things that would predate what we have come across here in the West. Actually, hold on a second here. Is there anything fun in here? Now, a movie that actually did do some decent rotoscope work, and once again that I love for purely aesthetic reasons only, is Sucker Punch. I would like to see a sequel to that movie. It needed more girls with guns in strange locations blowing things up. As for the story... Story. Who needs that? No, 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 no. Wish they had a freaking teleporter down here. All right, you know what? Go ahead and top off here. All right, we're gonna go ahead and top off here, and then we are gonna head back to the surface. See if there's one or two more places we missed. I'm trying to think. I think we thought we had everything though. Left leg, right arm, right arm. Literally, we probably are only missing. So we got the torso. Yeah, if worse comes to worse, I'll crack open an FAQ, but I think we're this close. We just need to just. Okay, so they've already got 
stone pillars down there. Let's see. Well, hello, pink flying young lady. Let's talk to you. What? Oh my god, this dude's cock blocking too? Oh, this guy. Light him up. Kerbos take a bite out of crime. Light him up. Uh oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Who's falling asleep? Mm -hmm. Nope. Nope. He deserves. Okay, I got two peeps who were asleep. What? No, you deserve shotgun to the face. That's what you deserve. Waifu, see if he likes lightning. One more time. Shotgun. Tastes so good. There we go. This jerk. Okay, so not down here. to add those. Alright, we went to this shrine the first time. Yeah, he already left us. We already kicked the crap out of him. He gave us some, the dude's arm or something. Now there's a guy saying these mountains or something. Still asleep? Alright, we'll wake her up here in a second after this. Oh, you can't use any magic. Alright, you know what? They're sealed. Auto the rest. Kill them all. Wife is awake. Haruka's not telling us where to go. Yeah, this one we already did. So we did one, we did two. This jerk. Alright. Yeah, yeah, it is. Dude, we'll entertain him. Oh, crap, crap, no, stop it, stop it, see, reflect the tax, everybody. Ugh, these jerks. Life is on a shoot herself to death. Well, we are out. Don't need it. Peace out, jerk. Man. Alright, wife who have an orb here. Keep yourself from dying. You two, wife who training. All right, everybody. Okay, everybody, I'm going to take a real quick break, grab a tasty beverage, plug in the laptop, and probably check out a quick FAQ to make sure we, we need to know where we're going. So I will be back shortly. In the meantime, everybody, please enjoy the tunes of Amiga 777.
back. Thank you very much for hanging on out. Once again, music provided provided by tonight has been done by Amiga Triple Seven. We will go ahead and hear more from him a little bit later. Okay, so I currently do have an FAQ up at this point in time. And I'm going to go through and actually take a quick look here because it looks like I think we've got everybody here. I thought we had we tackled everything. Went to the left side, exiting here. We got the right flag. Yeah, we went to that place with a weird wall. Let's see. Floors. That's what we just did. Beat this guy. The head and the torso. Yeah, Richard finds the doctor there. So we already got the head and the torso. Okay, hold on a second here. Okay, you know what? I think it's the torso is the thing we're actually missing here. Hold on a second here. Okay, your torso wants to go six five. Okay, no, no, we need to get the torso. Oh, wait a minute! I think I know where we need to go now. There was a guy we unfroze or like earlier on in the game. I'm talking like months back, and this guy was just like, yeah, I don't know what I'm doing here. He felt like really just deprived. And every time we spoke to him, he didn't say anything. Okay, we need to get out of here. We need to warp somewhere. Was this, this walking around is killing me here. Okay. Awesome, Amiga. Amiga, thanks for dropping in those links, buddy. first found waifu in training, and that's also where we had to rescue uh, waifu number two, who we currently have now, Chris. I just gotta remember where that was, man. That place is so far, so far long ago. 
<laughs> Div Verger, what's up? You're part of the crew. Thank, thank you. Guys, haven't seen you guys in a while. You guys were awesome. Sorry, I need money. Boom, boom, sword, son. time, ladies. Good lord. Alright, round. Go out that way. Okay. Solid. Well, 
solid walls. What's up, guys? Talk to the guy to get the to got we already got the head. second everybody Right. 
that's right, I said, oh yeah, the guys appeared down here, etc. etc. Ladies, you know, you hide. Damn, dude. Coming out cock like, no, don't talk to her, talk to me. I'm like, damn. Alright, let's see. Holy Town Factory, Arcadia. Let's go to Arcadia. Man, oh man, trying to get back to that one place is just a problem. Welcome. Good to see you again. How you doing? Oh, let's see here. No, Arcadia is not where we need to be. Go back. south of the factory. At least I hope. We're gonna find out, man. 